So, this is it. After a very long and totally exhausting drive, I have finally arrived in Torun, Poland, for the World Championships. The first day is only devoted to the registration and to the official opening ceremony in the evening. The atmosphere is great, like in Olympic Games or something. A check-in in the hotel, finding a place to park my car and off to the opening ceremony. Then a good night's sleep, looking forward to tomorrow's race. Three thousand meter race. Actually, I have never raced in an indoor track before this championships. So formally, my three thousand meter result here would be. Uh, naturally, my personal best time since uh, it's the first occasion of the event for me. However, my goal was to improve on my overall personal best time in 3000 meters. I had run this distance in stadium several times, but in the last years I haven't been able to improve my time of 10 minutes and 31 seconds, which I have run about 5 years ago. I cannot compare me with the best guys in my 35 plus age group from all over the world, of course. I knew they'll be fast, but I was quite sure I won't be the last one either. Dziewiętnastu zawodników na liście startowej, w tym ośmiu Polaków. The most part of the competition went off like for a sprint from the start. I settled in the back of the field and found my own pace there. Uh, in the opening lap, I overtook one other guy. 
but that was it. I didn't fight with anybody other than that in this race. I didn't overtake anyone and nobody overtook me. If you don't count uh, overtaking by a lap, uh, which was done both to me and by me. So, all in all, I ran pretty even race, finishing strongly in 10 minutes and 19.75 seconds, a new personal best, at last, after all these years. I'm very satisfied with the result. It's uh, 14th place in the world. Very happy about it. Nothing else today, just resting, some leg rolling on a foam roller, eating a bit and getting ready for tomorrow's race. The next day after the first race I raced again. Uh, this time it was a cross-country race of 8 kilometers. It seems strange to me that uh, a cross-country has been included in the indoors championships. But whatever. There are also other outdoor races like a 10k and a half marathon, for example. So about the 8k race, then it was held in four laps, each lap two kilometers, in the park or should I say a little forest nearby the Arena Torun, the arena of the Torun city. The course was somewhat hilly, with several small ascents and descents. Sometimes there were also loose sand, uh, but in general it was uh, quite runnable. Um, I had a good competition as well, and that certainly helped me run my best. The most part of the distance I tried to do my best to keep up with the Spanish guy. Yesterday he finished 10 seconds behind me in the 3000 meter race. But today he ran away from me in the final lap. Uh, then at the beginning of the final lap I catched up uh, another runner from Germany, who is normally much faster than me. Yesterday he ran 3000 meters in 9.36 or something. But today I over overtook him in the beginning of the final lap, then moved a bit even away from him, but at the end he overtook me again and finished a couple of seconds ahead of me. Well, no sorrow here, I'm again fully satisfied with my race, which was uh, run very equally again. Represent Latvia, represent Latvia at the finish line. We have a strong uh, represent of Latvia during this Indoor World Championship in Toru. Only uh, two seconds uh, were between uh, the difference between my fastest and my slowest laps, only two seconds uh, in two kilometer lap. Crazy, no? Uh, so yeah, the result for the 8 kilometers was 31 minute and 32 seconds, 31, 32. So, I was able to rest for one full day before my third competition on Wednesday, March 27. This time it was a 10k road race, but I don't have any footage of my running, so I'll just speak briefly about how I did there. Well, you can watch some videos of the city of Torun, which I filmed after the race while walking a bit around. So, after getting personal bests in the first two events, I was of course hoping for a personal best in the 10k as well. My previous best time was officially 37.22. Also, unofficially, I ran 7 seconds faster in a race where there was not a chip time showed afterwards. Uh, this time I started running just at my personal best pace and luckily there were enough runners uh, who also ran at about the same pace because several men's age groups were running together in this heat M35 to M55 Actually the second kilometer was my slowest one in 348 
while I adapted to the rhythm. Uh, the track was organized along just one street in general, five kilometers in one direction and five kilometers back. For the first few kilometers I tried to keep up with a Lithuanian guy, but after a 4k mark or so I felt I could go faster and left him. I ran the first half distance of 5 kilometers in about 1850, so I was a bit off the pace, but at that point I was still quite fresh. On my way back I overtook some runners who were already spent, and in the final part of the race I was even able to speed up a bit. As a result, the last kilometer was my fastest one, 330, and in total I ran negative splits for the race. However, the total time was 37.25, just 3 seconds slower than my personal best. And again, this was the full time, including the time I spent running to the start line. My own Garmin, which I started on the start line, showed 37.21, a new personal best by 1 second. Well, these things happen. Nevertheless, I am very satisfied with the race and with the 14th place in my age group in the world. Not bad for an amateur like me. And the final race for me was the 1500 meters, two days after the 10k road race. The 1500s was the discipline where there was the greatest possibility for me to finish in the last place in my age group, because I don't have the speed necessary for such a short distance. After the start I set myself comfortably at the end of the pack, and it turned out there is one local Polish guy even slower than me. So this was it, I just settled in in the pre-ultimate position and kept it to the end. I was cheered up by the fellow countrymen the whole distance. Although I got lapped in the final lap by the leaders, I set a new personal best of 4.49.67. I'm very satisfied with this result and also with the whole championships in general. Three personal bests in four races, well, not bad at all, I think. It was a really valuable experience and a great motivation for me to keep training, keep running, keep myself fit to be able to participate in such uh, events uh, also in the future. So that's it. My trip ends here. Thank you all for following my journey towards World Masters Athletics Championships. It was a tough journey of 24 episodes, and I hope we'll meet again when I'll train for another event. So see you soon, and goodbye.